Dear brothers and sisters in Christ, welcome to the Pastor's Corner for the week of February 22nd. This week I'd like to say a few words about the Sacrament of Reconciliation or Confession. The Lord gave us a beautiful gift in the sacrament, and over the centuries, countless numbers of men and women have found mercy, peace, and the courage to rise from their falls to continue their pressing forward to the high priced calling of life in Christ Jesus. God knows that we are sinners, and in his goodness, he gave the church this healing sacrament to grant us pardon and peace. Many people get caught up on why does the church say it's necessary to go to a priest to confess your sins. This is completely understandable. I'm a sinner. I go to confession myself, so I can understand why people ask that question. Before I answer it, first let me just explain that the moment we find ourselves in sin, we should always repent interiorly out of love for God and knowledge of the terrible effects of sin. This should be an ongoing reality in our lives at all times. But because sin is not only affects our personal relationship with the Lord, but also our relationship with other members of the body of Christ, it must be seen as such. Sin is an offense against God, our own dignity bought by the blood of Christ, and an offense that affects the members in the body of Christ. The church teaches that it's only necessary to go to confession when a person is in a state of mortal sin. This means we have done something very wrong, grave matter. We did it freely, and we did it knowing it was wrong. The priest stands as a representative of the community and extends God's pardon and peace to the individual welcoming them back into communion. You know what? You have no idea what a privilege it is to remind people in the sacrament that God is on their side, to seek a word of scripture, to help them in their future struggles, and to pray for healing and absolution. It is a sacred duty and an incredible blessing to be a confessor. It's something that I always take very seriously. And you know the priest is bound by the seal of confession never to divulge or share what was said during the celebration of the sacrament. It's truly a safe place. And in our church, a person can go face to face with the confessor or the priest, or they're free to go behind a screen, whatever is their personal preference. If you've been away from the sacrament for a while, I want to encourage you to take another look at the importance of it and consider coming back. At St. Brendan's, we have confessions on Saturdays from 3 p.m. to 4.45 p.m., and you always have the opportunity to schedule an appointment with me or Father Ron if you'd like more time or if that day and time of celebration is not convenient for you. I'm currently working on a video guide on making a good confession and should have that available at the end of this week. Don't miss out on all the grace the Lord wants to give to you through this beautiful sacrament. As scripture says, Then I declared my sin to you, my guilt I did not hide. I said, I confess my transgressions to the Lord and you took away the guilt of my sin. Check out my website for the Guide on Confession in a few days, and thank you very much for watching this week's Pastor's Corner. I wish you a most blessed week.